in today's video lecture we are going to see question number 21 in cbsc and crt textbook probability and question number 12 for ssc probability chapter only so the first question is a lot consists of 144 ball pens of which 20 are defective and the others are good nuri will buy a pen if it is good but will not buy if it is defective the shopkeeper draws one pen at random and gives it to her what is the probability that number one she will buy it and number two she will not buy it so here first of all it is telling a lot a lot means a collection is there and in that collection uh, of ball pens 144 ball pens are there total so first we'll write given total number of ball pens is equals to 144 total ball pens is equals to 144 then it is telling me of which 20 are defective defective means they are not in a good condition they are not in a working condition so number of defective pens is equals to 20 then it is telling uh, Nuri will buy a pen if it is good but will not buy if it is defective that is she will purchase a pen only if the pen is in working condition and she will not purchase if it is not in working condition now the shopkeeper is drawing one pen at random and the shopkeeper is giving that pen to her that is the shopkeeper does not know whether the pen is good or defective he just takes it at random and gives it to her the question is what is the probability that number one she will buy it so when will Nuri buy it it is saying that she will buy it when it is in good condition okay so the probability that p of she will buy it the formula is we know number of favorable outcomes by total outcomes So number of variable outcomes here is number of variable outcomes means what is it asking me what is the probability that she will buy it so the probability that she will buy it means number of variable outcomes so uh, the probability that she will buy it means it is uh, good in good condition so number of pens which are good that you have to find out number of pens which are good is equals to total number of pens 144 minus defective pens that is 20 144 minus 20 is 124 so number of pens which are good is 124 there is number of favorable outcomes is 124 number of favorable outcomes is equals to 124 now it is asking me first bit probability that she will buy it is number of favorable outcomes by total outcomes that is equals to number of favorable outcomes is 124 by total outcomes total pens are 144 we'll divide this with two table two six are 12 two twos are four two sevens are 14 two twos are four two threes are six two ones are two two threes are six one two two six are 12 answer is 31 by 36 there is a probability that nuri buys a pen is 31 by 36 let us move to the second bit the probability that she will not buy it when will nuri not buy it when the pen is defective right so probability that she will not buy it number of defective pens is 20 so number of variable outcomes in second bit is 20 so substituting the same formula probability that she will not buy it is equals to number of variable outcomes by total outcomes that is equals to number of variable outcomes is 20 but total outcomes that is total number of pens is 144 so 20 by 144 by 20 because 20 are defective pens by total pens are 144 that only it is asking that she will not buy it when she will not buy it when the pens are defective so defective pens by total pens two tens are 20 two sevens are 14 two twos are four two fives are 10 two threes are six one two two six are 12 five by 36 so the probability that nuri does not buy a pen is five by 36 